Hello kids, how are you all? I hope you all are fine and safe at home. I welcome you all to Nagesh Karazgi Orchid School channel. I am Ms. Parvati Chaugule, your first grade English teacher. Students, in last episode what we have seen? Yes, we have seen one lesson. What was the name of our lesson? Yes, it was the clouds. We have seen in that lesson how the two clouds started to fight, how they cried and what happened? Yes, the children on the earth, they enjoyed raining, isn't it? They enjoyed rain and they laughed and they played. Now, today, on the basis of our understanding of the lesson, we will solve questions. Okay. Before going to solve the questions, we will see one video. The clouds. Once a big cloud in the sky met another cloud. The first cloud shouted and pushed the second cloud. The second cloud became angry and became a rain cloud. The first did the same. The two clouds crashed into each other. The children down below looked up and said, We see lightning! We hear thunder! It's going to rain! Soon, the two angry clouds started to cry. It's raining! <laughs> it's raining! The little children laughed. They cried so much that they turned into small white clouds. And soon, the strong wind blew the fighters far away. Yes, in this way, we have seen how the two clouds grieve into small clouds, small white clouds and soon the strong wind blew the fighters far away. Isn't it? Yes. Now, today we will solve questions based on our understanding. Okay. First is reading. On the basis of our reading, we will solve first question. Fill in the blanks. Using the words given in the box. This is the box and in this some words are given. And now we have to solve the questions based. We have to fill the blanks. Isn't it? Yes. Now we will fill these blanks using the words given in the box. So now. What is our first question? C. The first cloud dashed the second cloud. What the first cloud did? Yes, the first cloud pushed the second cloud. So what will come in the first blank? Pushed. P U S H E D. Pushed. The second cloud. The first cloud pushed the second cloud. Take down in your textbook students. Yes, the first cloud pushed the second cloud. Now the next question. The two clouds dash each other. What it will come in the blank? The two clouds crashed into each other. Crashed. C R A S H E D. Crashed into each other. Crashed into each other. Now the next one. The children below saw lightning and 
dash what will come in the blank the children below saw lightning and thunder yes t h u n d e r thunder now the next question is the children below saw lightning and heard dash so what will come in the third blank yes the children below saw lightning and heard thunder t write t t h u n d e r thunder okay now the next one is what is our next question c the children dash when it started raining what the children did the children dash when it started raining yes the children laughed when it started raining what they did they laughed l a u g h e d laughed l a u g h e d laughed now the next question is soon the two angry clouds begin to cry yes soon the two angry clouds begin to cry c r y cry okay c c r y cry c r y cry once again we will see the first two clouds oh, sorry the first cloud pushed the second cloud p u s h e d pushed the second cloud the first cloud pushed the second cloud next the two clouds crashed into each other c r a s h e d crashed into each other next the children below saw lightning and heard thunder and heard t h u n d e r thunder isn't it c the first cloud pushed the second cloud the two clouds crashed into each other the children below saw lightning and heard thunder the children laughed when it started raining soon the two angry clouds began to cry do it fast take down your in your textbook okay are you done with it shall we move towards our next question okay we now we will move towards our next question okay what is our next question c in this question what we have to do is arrange these sentences in the right order so 
means what is the meaning of this question in this some sentences are given to you okay now we have to arrange these sentences according to the story see first of all we will read these sentences and then we will arrange the sentences according to the story first sentence the first cloud pushed the second cloud okay second sentence the two angry clouds started to cry then the next one once a big cloud in the sky met another cloud next the two clouds crashed into each other next soon the strong wind blew the fighters far away next they turned into small white clouds next question sorry next sentence the second cloud became angry and became a rain cloud now we will arrange these sentences okay see first one is done for us once a big cloud in the sky met another cloud now what what was the second event in the story yes the first cloud pushed the second cloud isn't it yes the first cloud pushed the second cloud this was our first sentence once a big cloud in the sky met another cloud this was first sentence next one the first cloud pushed the second cloud so here we will write two okay it is the second sentence now which is the next sentence yes the second cloud became angry and became a rain cloud this is the third sentence the second cloud became angry and became a rain cloud this is the third sentence okay this is the third sentence now which is the fourth sentence see the two clouds crashed into each other isn't it yes the two clouds crashed into each other this is the fourth sentence this was the third this is the fourth the two clouds crashed into each other here we have to write four okay the this is the fourth sentence the two clouds crashed into each other okay this is the fourth sentence now fifth one the two angry clouds started to cry isn't it the two angry clouds started to cry this is our fifth sentence this is our fifth sentence the two angry clouds so fifth sentence is the two angry clouds started to cry now which sentence sentences remain see they turned into small white clouds yes this is our sixth sentence they turned into small white 
clouds and seventh one is done for us soon the strong wind blew the fighters far away isn't it see now we have arranged these sentences now we will read these sentences according to the number and then we will get the story first sentence once a big cloud in the sky met another cloud the first cloud pushed the second cloud the second cloud became angry and became a rain cloud the two clouds crashed into each other the two angry clouds started to cry soon the strong wind blew the fighters far away the two cloud sorry soon the strong wind blew the fighters far away yes we have missed this sentence they turned into small white clouds then soon the strong wind blew the fighters far away so now take down in your textbook these the, the order of the sentences so that we have got the yes we have got the story do it fast okay have you done with it now we will move towards the next question okay what is our next question c okay we have to do the language in use language in use okay say this look at the pictures where is the cat we have to see the picture in first picture where is the cat sitting yes the cat is in the box the cat is inside the box second the cat is on the box in second picture where is the cat yes the cat is on the box here the cat is in the box and here the cat is on the box so the words in and on tells us where someone or something is where someone someone or something is the words in and on tell us where someone or something is yes isn't it see the cat is in the box the word in tells us where is the cat and in the second picture the cat is on the box the word on tells us where is the cat now we will solve the question the next question based on our language in use see look at the picture circle the right answer this is the picture given to us and now we have to tell where the things are okay where the things r c in the first sentence the bird sits in slash on the branch where is the bird children tell me where is the bird yes the bird is on the branch so we will circle this on the branch the bird sits on the branch now next sentence 
the eggs are in obliques on the nest where are the eggs yes the eggs are in the nest where are the eggs the eggs are in the nest next sentence the fish is in slash on the water where will be the fish where is the fish you see yes this is a fish the fish is in the water where is the fish the fish is in the water now the next sentence the bee is in slash on the flower where is the bee this is the bee now where she is yes she is on the flower on the flower the bee is on the flower now the next sentence is the frog is in slash on the rock where is the frog sitting see here is the frog now where it is it is on the rock it is on the rock so you have to do in your textbook do it fast the bird sits on the branch the eggs are in the nest the fish is in the water the bees sorry the bee is on the flower the frog is on the rock the frog is on the rock so shall we move towards our next question yes now we will go for our next question see this yes look at the picture fill in the blanks with in or on we have to fill the blank with in or on the bag is where is the bag children yes the bag is on the chair where is the bag the bag is on the chair on the chair the bag is on the chair next the crayons are in the cup where are the crayons yes these are the crayons and they are in the cup in the cup the books are the books are in the bag isn't it the books are in the bag the books are in the bag next question the lamp is on the desk yes the lamp is on the desk the lamp is on the desk once again i will read the sentences for you the bag is on the chair the crayons are in the cup the books are in the bag the lamp is on the desk the lamp is on the desk now what is the next question see now we have to solve the puzzle complete the puzzle using the picture clues these are the pictures and now we have to fill this cross puzzle okay now what is the first see children this is the first picture and 
we have to write the name of this picture down okay down so now we will write what is this yes this is umbrella c u m b r e l l a umbrella u m b r e l l a umbrella now where is what is the second picture yes it is a rainbow what is this this is the rainbow r a i n b o w rainbow isn't it now the cross see what is that third picture yes the third picture is of lightning so this is l i g h t n i n g lightning l i g h t n i n g lightning and the last one is the picture of cloud yes it is a picture of cloud c l o u d cloud isn't it yes so in this way we have filled this puzzle take down in your textbook do it fast now we will move towards the next question what is our next question say this we have to listen an audio and then we have to fill these blanks students listen the audio carefully one be careful see what is the first sentence be careful where you can see this yes this is a picture so we will write here one we will write here one okay wait now which is the next one two what is the problem see second one what is the problem three we can play hooray and the last one is we can play hooray so now we will fill the boxes see this was the first one be careful okay then what was the second yes this was the second and the last one is hooray now we can play isn't it yes now what we have to do is it is about the pronunciation remember the words you practiced say these words aloud and revise the words and revise the words now once again you have to listen the audio pool pull fool full look look boot book shoot shoot c p o o l pull p u l l pull f o o l fool and f u l l pull full f u l l next l o o p loop l o o k look 
B O O T boot B O O K book S H O O T shoot S H O O K shook so these were the words now the next one is the speaking skill okay see now look at the pictures say the dialogues you have to look at the pictures and say the dialogues see what is the first sentence from the picture i want to be a writer okay i want to be a writer what do you want to be bobby so see a girl first she told what she want to be she said i want to be a writer then she asks a boy named bobby and what she ask what do you want to be bobby now see the next dialogue box i want to be a doctor he replies i want to be a doctor and then he asks a girl named parul what do you want to be parul then what she answers see i want to be a pilot so this type of conversation is going between the children now this is a picture carry on this way with the pictures and the words given here now you have to ask means first you have to tell what you want to be then ask your friend and then he will ask the other one okay now we will move towards our next question see this it is about the story writing the story of goldilocks the story of goldilocks and the three bears is given below but the order of pictures is mixed read the sentences and write the right numbers below the picture what we have to do yes we have to read these sentences and then according to these sentences we have to write the numbers in the box okay now what is the first sentence see goldilocks went to the house of the three bears this is written here one goldilocks went to the house of the three bears next one she ate baby bears porridge the she ate baby bears porridge where she ate yes this is the second sentence which it shows then the next she broke baby bears chair where you can see yes this is the third where she broke baby bears chair next she fell asleep in baby bears bed where she feels asleep yes this is the fourth one where she feels asleep in the baby bears bed next one the bears came home and found goldilocks sleep the baby sorry the bears came home and found goldilocks sleep this is the fifth picture now the next and the last one is goldilocks woke up and ran away goldilocks wake up and ran away this is the sixth one so in this way we have seen the questions based on the our chapter the clouds so students in this way we have seen the questions based on our understanding of the chapter the 
clouds have you enjoyed the chapter and the questions i too enjoyed with you thank you